Oh, I think I know what I might be missing. I think it might be here. In one of these windows. Ah, yes, it is. Okay, so good thing I turned it back to a barren bird because I had just about lost hope. I thought that there was a thing on the roof that I had to go, uh... That I had to go in as a pumpkin. But no. Uh, what? But no, I actually have to go here. Collect the final jiggy. And now I think... I still have more notes to go. Um... Okay, so I have not 100%ed this... this level yet. I need to find some way to get to the very top of this building as a pumpkin. But I'm really not seeing any viable ways to get up here. So if there are not nine notes in here, there probably are. Oh. Okay, fantastic. All right. So we're done with this level. So I do need to get back to Mumbo. Oh. Okay, so I was going to lose a health one way or another. All right, let's transform into a pumpkin, X the world, and then we're never seeing this world again. This level. Oh, come on. Get the hell out of here. Once and for all. Let's see where. It's down these steps, right? That's where the exit is? Nope, that's not it. Okay, it's definitely right here. Goodbye, mansion. Oh god. Oh fuck off. Uh, can you Why do you run faster than I do? Oh, that's fine. I have no idea what exactly is in store here. Is it the next puzzle? Wait, what? Why would I need you? I guess it must be to bust this coffin open. Ah. This is how I get to Rusty Bucket Bay. But now is there anything else I need to do here? as a banjo. Not unless it's a way to bust these coffin coffins over o open. Sheesh. Alright, I guess not. So let's turn back into a pumpkin because we can't even get out of this place if we're not. Mumbo, if you kill me, I guarantee you I will kill you back. 
<laughs> Good thing you die in the next game, right? <laughs> Just kidding, he doesn't. Steady. Slow and steady. Alright. I'm pretty sure this is the way. Oh no. It's another cheat. Another spell they get. Wait, that's some pretty poor grammar there. <laughs> then, then Cheeto shall grunty burn. You mean then? Wait, I wasn't paying attention. That, that, that cheat was red feathers, right? Oh, oh. All right, really concentrating here. All right, I think I can't go much further. Yep. So I'm assuming that to open the next level, I'll have to go just a little bit further than I did last time. But that's okay. Uh, let's go back to Treasure Trove Cove, shall we? Let's put in some cheats. <laughs> Let's get some double eggs and double feathers. Hell yeah. Wait, what? I know I've already done this. Wait, did I not get this before? Okay, then. You know what? I guess you're right. Maybe I didn't get it before. In that case, it's probably another thing that, it, that I forgot to get. Like the one where I have to jump down the... Uh, Jump down the golden vase to get that chicken. Maybe out because there's only two more levels to go. And uh, so that would put me up at eight jiggies if I got all of them. Shit, wait, let me look at my totals. Yeah, that would put me at eight. Which means there's two that I'm missing. Alright, this isn't where I want to go. This is where I want to go. Right now. Oh. Alright, again, this is where I want to go. Zero fails, zero deaths. <sighs> Wait a minute. What was the, uh... Now let's see if this works. Okay, it does work. Excuse me, will you die, please? All right, next is an L. Oh, 
Oh, yes. I was hoping they would give it to me immediately. Won't help bear and chicken legs. Alright, red feathers. Shit, I swear I used to know where each of these letters were by heart. Very nice. Oh wait, oh, I didn't even get to see what Grunty says about it. For easy peek, we've definitely gotten because I got it in this very uh, play session. Gobi's Valley. Shit, where did Gobi's Valley pop up? Oh, I didn't get that one yet. No, no, that's in... Yes, this is the one. Okay, good. Oops. I'll wait for it to come back around again. All right, so two more will put me up at nine. If I get Rusty Buckets and Ma Mad Muster Mansion. Now, I'm not convinced that I've gotten Mad Muster Mansions. Although I am convinced that I've gotten the uh, Switch. Oh, yes, that's up here, right? All right, let me kill you. Oh shit, I do need the uh, flight pad again. God damn it, I have to do this shit again. All right, fine, whatever. I'll do it again. Wow, that is really, uh, <laughs> really cutting it close there. All right. Epic. So I've gotten all of the, uh, gotten all the jiggies for all the witch switches I've pushed so far. So now, let's go back toward Rusty Bucket Bay. Crazy how much how much of this gap I'm closing in this almost nine year old let's play. So what did that lead to again? Oh yeah, that was just a nothing kind of thing. That's alright, I've, I've already gotten 200 eggs. And 100 gold feathers. So now I need to find a way to unlock this door. And to do that... Oh, hello. Okay, good. So now I never have to swim again to get here. <laughs> All right, cool. This is the way to unlock the level. Yes, yes, yes. But before I go there... Wait. Okay, I've already been there. That's why I unlocked the secret. The secret teleport.
I think there's a there's a taller level that I can raise the water to. But I think it might be inside the level. Oh, yes. We've done it! Let's see what's around this way. Is it another Cheeto? Shit, I have no idea at all. Oh. Oh, wait, this is just a way to, uh where I already was before, um, to unlock the level that we just went into. I mean, that we just came from. Alright, great. So, next step, I'm sure, is to enter Rusty Bucket Bay. Now that's where we need to be. I think we can only get up there after entering this level. So, next time on Banjo Kazooie, we're gonna get a little rusty. Goodbye. And I think I'm calling it a night. So let's go ahead and save.